I'm Nalise and I'm here in Inkster at Colonial Park. Hi, I'm reporting live in Inkster. I'm standing here with Bone at the Sunoco. I'm standing here with Yasmin, who is Sean, aka Chop's sister. My father was shot to death in his kitchen in his home as he read his Bible. Were you at work when someone was shot and killed right in the middle of the road running from the other barbershop across the street? Yes. Yeah, my cousin got killed four years ago. Tyrell? Yeah, say his name. Tyrell Walker. Do you feel like the media portrays Inkster in a negative light? It makes it worse than it really is? I do. Because they got the story wrong. It's not even the right story. They look at it from one person's point of view and not the other point of view. It's not Inkster. It's the people. It's not Inkster. I don't believe everything that the media would say about Inkster is true, but they're close. You can't just label the whole city as just bad because of a handful over here and a handful over here. You can't do that. Well, crime and corruption so bad in one U.S. city that it decided to do away with its police force. And what's the what's the worst thing that you've seen happen in Inkster? My friend, baby, getting killed. Gunman opens fire in Inkster, in an Inkster neighborhood, killing a two-year-old girl. Another child and an adult were also wounded. Girl, do you feel like proper justice was served? I don't know the end result of that, but there's no justice for that. Hopefully we'll get people to understand that there's way more good 